Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So if you haven't seen my first run, go check on my channel and take a look at that video. I went in with all Cosmics and we got her done. This is the second run where I can't use a Cosmic. That's it. I can use any other class except Cosmic. So that's the team I decided to go in with. Dr. Doom, Kitty Pride, and of course, Tiger. Now, the reason that I chose Kitty Pride isn't because I'm really good with her. It's because I'm not. And so I want to get some practice in. I've seen what she can do. She can solo every one of these fights in the right hands. I'm not the right hands, okay? So what you're seeing here is me learning Kitty and practicing, uh, fighting with her. Now, this fight here was very annoying, okay? I wasn't sure why it was so annoying, but many times I went to dash back and didn't move, okay? Especially with Moda. So you'll see there, suddenly, it's like my feet are glued to the floor, and then he's just like, headbutt, full combo, you're dead. So I had to restart. Because I was determined to get at least a decent run in on this first fight. You know, so we go back in again with Kitty. And I'm not playing her extremely well. But basically what I want to do is build up eventually to 10 prowesses. So that my attacks are unblockable. With the uh, Tigra synergy. All right, and once that's happening, it should be an easier fight, okay? You can see here I'm still having some issues with Modot and his movements and, and all of that. I'm not sure what was going on. Now, at three prowesses, we were good. We could at least phase while we were dashing. Now, you want to do a lot of intercepts. And with Kitty, it's very safe to do intercepts when she has three or more prowesses. Because even if you mess up, you don't take damage if you are awakened. You don't take any damage if they decide to counter you because you messed up. Now, even unawakened, Kitty can do it, but she will take some damage. Not a lot, but at least some damage. Okay? So, as you can see here, I'm thinking, all right, we're good. We're, we're in the cycle. All right? Now, here... I decided to back off and then I dashed in into his special now when I was done with this I was thinking you know what the node if I remember correctly when I fire a special off uh, they get power drained so I don't have to bait it out as long as I have a special attack okay so for example right here I think it was this one, uh, I could have just fired my special off. But more often than not, I sit here and I wait for them to, you know, either fire their special or for the tranquility to uh, take away their uh, power. Like, see here? And so I, like, dashed in because I was like, oh, no. Now what do I do? And, of course, dashing back, I wasn't phased. And I was doing pretty well there. Now, I described this to uh, one of my subscribers, and he told me what to do in that situation. If they get to their special three, instead of me doing um, as many hits as I was doing, maybe just do one hit, back off, one hit, back off. Um, because when I do the one hit and back off, I'll still be phased for a little bit longer. And then you just have to hope that they fire their special three while you're phased. But... As you saw, that was a pretty good run, but I was like, okay, I'm getting this fight. I can do better, okay? Uh, so I was like, all right. Um, hold on, somebody sent me a message there. Okay, so there I am getting clobbered again, and I'm like, you know what, forget that. I'm not gonna do it. I don't wanna deal with that. Um, Okay, hold on. Uh, had my mom asking me a question here. Uh, so I just restarted it. Didn't care, but 
I'm just learning the fight. And I know, I know in my heart of hearts that I can do this fight and uh, get it done with Kitty. So all of this is good practice. That's why I brought her. All right, so um, you see that I'm starting to dash into his uh, specials a little bit more. I didn't dash there because he did it too quickly and I wasn't phased. All right, so here we go. I'm unblockable. All right, dash back. Here we go. And we're doing it. And this time, I basically built up my prowesses so that I don't lose them right away when I get hit like that in my phase. Because then I'm like, oh, wait, all my prowesses went away. And now I'm back to square one. So better to uh, max out my prowesses or, or at least get like 20 of them. And then I can do the little dash in. Now, that's just one style with Kitty. Okay. So you see here, we timed it so that he got his special three, but he lost all the power. And then you see here, I'm dashing right into the specials. And then that happened. Like I said, plenty of problems dealing with uh, Modoc. All right. So here, I'm just going in and see how I timed it. I'm watching the timer now. All right. I don't want to um, get caught like I did before with him at a special three and, and me trying to, you know, phase and hope he fires it off. Don't want to do that. Okay. And you see, I dashed in again, uh, lost some prowess, but I'm still good. See, like right there, still good. We're still at 10 prowess like that. And pretty much I'm like, okay, now right there, I couldn't move. I don't know why. I just couldn't move. So I'm like, okay, whatever. There we go, dashed in again. We're back up. And now see there, I was able to dash. No problem. Just really funny things. I was watching uh, Brian Grant and he was having problems too. You know, he was like, I know I dexed and I didn't move. And I was like, yeah, I was having that problem too. Okay, what you see here? One, two, three. Now, I don't know if three hits is the best to do because I noticed that after three hits, she's not phased anymore. Is two hits better? Leave a comment. Let me know. Okay. Maybe uh, I should just be doing uh, the two hits, backing off, and then uh, wash, rinse, and repeat. All right. So here we go again. Now, I could have dashed in right there, but it was too close to the end. But we got the solo. Got the solo. It wasn't pretty, but we got the solo. Bad boy. We got the solo, though. It, it, it was ugly, but we did get the solo. So now we got Craven. Now, this is why I brought Doom. You know Doom can cheese this fight. And when I did it, I got the solo with Doom. Did not have to um, uh, uh, deal with that root mechanic or anything like that. So why am I going in here with uh, Kitty? Because I'm trying to learn Kitty. So I brought Doom in in case I just got real frustrated with Kitty, but I was actually having a little fun. Look at this. Boom. And I'm back in. Look at her. Look at her go. So I was actually liking this. This was fun. Now that was just me. But look at that. All of that, I would have been taking damage, but I was phased. Loving it. And then I did this right here so I could get around that trap and did a good bit of damage. Now, keep in mind, this is the first time I'm even fighting against Craven with Kitty. I got caught there. Okay. And then I kept forgetting. This was more of a me issue. Okay. Yeah, that was all me. Because when he's unstoppable, I can parry him. But I get used to not parrying him when he's in the unblockable mode. So I had to watch for the unstoppable, parry, knock him down with a heavy, and then go back to the rotation. Didn't do that. You know, hindsight, 2020. 
I learn better. But it's all right. We're going. We're going. We're learning. But look at the chunk of health that I took from him. And that was just my first try ever fighting against uh, Craven. So we're doing pretty good. Now, I did a five hit combo there because I was wanting to push him to his special two. The special two is where it's at. Okay. But just look at this. I'm loving this, man. Back it in. And we're able to push him to a special two pretty easily. All right. And then here we go. Go back in. Go back in. And we're just doing the kitty. That's what I'm going to call it. Doing the kitty. Look at that. I did an extra hit because, you know, I wanted to get him to a special two. All right. So now I'm at a special three. And I'm like, hmm. May as well keep going. Just look at this. Sweetness, man. Even when I had to deal with the traps, it wasn't too terrible, you know? All right, here we're trying to get him to fire off that special uh, two. He don't want to. I don't blame him. All right, there he goes. All right. Ooh. And I finally saw the timer that uh, lets me know when a trap, uh, where I'm about to get rooted because I'm too far away. Just look at all that. And I'm like, hey, we're doing good. So I'm like, let me fire off my special three. He's low in health. Let's see what we can do to him. Just torch him. Ooh. Almost got him. Almost got him. All right. But then he died. He died because he tried to hit us. So my first try against Craven. How'd I do? Now, this fight here, I watched Brian Grant do this fight, and I felt for him. I was like, oh, my goodness. Now, I don't know how good she's going to do against this, okay? I've never fought um, Penny with Kitty. Same thing with the Craven, right? So I went ahead and did the same thing, built up um, the prowesses. And then you see right there, and then I got hit out of phase, and I'm like, okay, don't know what went on right there, but okay, we're good. And then I forgot that the further I'm away, I take degen damage. And then she just caught me going backwards. It, it happens, okay? Now, I was like, all right, we didn't do a lot of damage. And now I remember Doom. I don't know how good Doom is for this fight. All right, so we just seeing how much uh, health we could take off. There she goes with her special one, which we don't really want her to fire. So therefore she fires it all the time. And he's not doing a whole lot of damage. There's a little bit of damage, but not a lot of damage. Okay. And I'm like, come on, come on. There we go. At least we got to the special two. All right. Still not a whole lot of damage. There we go. And then it was at this point I remembered. She's incinerate immune. Huh. So that didn't have the punch that I was hoping it would. And of course I stayed away too long. Died to the DJ. So I was like, okay. I said, let me let me uh try some Tiger. Eh, why not? You know? I was thinking that I would use a, a team revive or something like that. So May as well. And then she just caught me good. Um, I did too many hits into the block. And she was waiting for me when I got done with my animation. And she let me know. That was not the way to go. All right. So trying to beat into her block. Pushed her to a special two. We did do a little bit of damage. Look at that. Sweetness. And got smacked right out of it. I don't really know how to fight with Tiger either. But... I was waiting for that. I was like, okay, she's going to have that component. And so I I, da I um, ducked all of those, and I'm like, yeah. I was like, oh, wait a minute. She has a follow-up. Boom. All right. So I'm like, uh, okay, let's go back to Kitty, because that's who I brought in. And I know I've seen Kitty do these fights. 
I'm learning how to fight with Kitty. All right, it's not Kitty, not her fault, my fault. All right, so here we go. Here we go, here we go. And we're doing a little bit better now. Yep, yep, pushed her to a special two. Okay. Now we wanna try to bait that special two out. There we go. And let's keep on going. What? Oh, and then she caught me. I hate that. She followed me back. You know, I did the hits and then I dashed back and she followed me. When that happens, you can't recover fast enough. They're right on you. It's like, okay, fine. That's good. Let's go back in. We're learning, we're learning. But we did a good amount of damage. So not too upset. And I'm getting good practice in uh, with Kitty. Look at that. Ooh, yeah. Look at that. That health went down a little bit. I like it. Okay, we got the intercept right there. But I wasn't unblockable yet. That's what I'm trying to get to. I want to get to that unblockable. And I do want to batter into her block too, of course, to get that sink shield down. Yep. Okay, come on. We got seven prowesses. There we go. Now we're unblockable. Now we can hurt her. Come on. Okay, now we got to get that out of her. Yep, yep, yep. Boom. And we go back in. All right, we're doing some good damage. Good, good damage. It's a little slow for my taste, but hey, it's working. All right, here we go. And we're back into it. I got power lock right there. But that's all right. <laughs> I'm just like, why am I power locked? All right, here we go. Come on. So we're doing good, we're doing good. Come on, we're getting her down a little bit out of time. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Okay, now we gotta bait this out. And we went down that time. For some reason, she did a double dash back. I'm like, okay, fine. But Kitty is <clears throat> doing a good job. And Penny, I probably called Penny Kitty at some point in time, but Penny, is gonna go down. You know, it, it didn't take too terribly much, and I'm getting some good practice in with uh, Kitty. All right, so uh, I'm learning, and I feel like I've done, I've learned more about Kitty in this uh, Eternity of Pain than I have previously. And for the final fight, you're gonna see, um, where I, I learned a little cheese with the true focus, all right? This time I was making sure I clamped down on that block because I don't know what's going on. Look at that, she's just staying out of my way. I'm just like, all right, whatever. And we're back to it. And like I said, I don't know if three is good, but it, it's doing it, <laughs> you know? It's getting her done. And then again, I'm, I'm uh, power locked. All right, there we go, that worked. She didn't do a double, double dash back there. All right, now here, I wasn't sure. I'm like, wait, I was unblockable, wasn't I? So we're, we're you know, that kind of threw me off. I was like, wait a minute. I thought I was unblockable, so how did she do that? But I wasn't sure what happened and that threw me off. And I'm just like, okay, well, wh whatever. That's fine. Let's go back in. So if you know why that happened, go back, rewind it, look through it. Let me know in the comments um, what happened there. Okay. So here we are again. Here we go again on my own. Going down the only road I've ever known. Nah, I can't go that high. Anyway, um, here we go. So there's an auto blocking again. We're not up uh, to eight to 10 prowesses yet. There we go. So now we're unblockable. Cool, cool. We're gonna get her this time. There we go, come on. 
I got a little nervous, even though she's at 1%. And I was just like, nah, because I, I don't want that that auto-blocking thing to happen. I, I was real nervous from the last fight. So 1%, I wasn't letting her get me at 1%. Now, we come to the final fight. Now, again, never fought him with Kitty. And I go through quite a few different tries and everything. See right there? Dead. Just came right in, said, here, have me. And he said, okay. And whooped my butt with a quickness. So I'm like, all right, you know what? That, that wasn't a, a really good try. You know? Um, Got to keep track of his uh, unstoppable. Got to keep track of the unblockable. And we got to build up our prowesses. He has that power gain. Really annoying. So in this fight, early on in the fight, you'll see me just trying different things. I'm, I'm going in here like that with Tigra because I'm like, okay, at least her neutralized uh, might be able to take care of the um, unstoppable, right? But it doesn't stop his um, power gain. And then as you saw there, he was firing his special off at just the right time so that I couldn't hit him and the neutralized wore off so he still got the unstoppable. So I was like, all right, I see the AI is gonna counter it. Um, so I'm not gonna use Kitty uh, against him. So back to, I mean, I'm not gonna use Tigra against him. So back to Kitty, all right? And um, it's more of the same until we get to a certain point where I got, I had an epiphany. I kind of fell into it. And you're gonna see it coming up, all right? So at this point, as you see, I'm just trying to, you know, catch him when the unstoppable is down. And, you know, we gotta deal with this power gain. All right, now I was like, wait, did I phase in time? Did I phase in time? So I'm watching it, no, didn't phase in time. I was like, okay. Whatever. I was like, this is going to be a, a annoying. But guess what? I could have soloed this with Kitty. I could have soloed it with Kitty. And I, 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 I learned it late in the fight. All right. So you saw I, I claimed my um, revives. I still had those expiring. Um, and I got, I think I ended up with, I still had like about 40 in my overflow when I got done. So it is what it is. Now here, I wanted to use Doom because I've seen people use Doom on this Dragon Man. And I'm just like, okay, I still don't know how to use Doom against Dragon Man, but I'm figuring keep the staggers up uh, to deal with the unstoppable like that because that unstoppable is the pain. But it's not really. You know what really is the pain? Do you know what killed me there? What killed me is parrying him when I didn't want to. That took away almost all my health. So I'm just like, whatever, just fire it off. You know, my suicide's gonna kill me, but hey. So I parried him by mistake. And that is nasty. You parry him, that degen that you get on you, it takes out so much of your health. It's not even funny. All right. Let me see. Who was that? Nope, nope, nope. Okay. So I wanted to try, you know, get another try in. And I'm like, this time, as you see there, I was just blocking. Okay. Wasn't even trying to uh, parry or anything. Intercepted there. And then he just got me. All right. Boom. Nullify. All right. We're good. We're good. All right. There we go. He's got two bars of power. So I like that. But I couldn't get the stagger on him in time, but I nullified it. I'm like, okay. Okay. We might be able to do this. Okay. So here we go again. Knocked him down. Put the stagger up. 
no unstoppable. Cool, cool. And I'm like, all right, I can I can see how we could do this fight with uh, Doom. All right, but see, now he's starting to play passive, and he's about to get that special three. But he fired his special two off, because I was, y'all don't know, I was sitting there going, really, bro? Really? That's what you're going to do? You ain't going to fire your special off? But he did. And I tried to get that stagger up, but I didn't get it up in time, so I got to deal with that. And then I parried him. And so I'm like, well, may as well fire off the special three. Because I'm dead now. So annoying. So I'm just like, may as well get as much damage in as I can. And it's some decent damage, you know. And I'm doing this nice little doom rotation here. But, of course, because of my suicides, I'm taking that recoil damage. And I'm just firing this off now to do as much as I could before I went down. That was it. Okay. So, back up again. I wanted to uh, give him another shot. Uh, at this point, I was like, I don't know if I could do it with Kitty. You know, the few tries that I had, I'm like, I'm like that, that, that it wasn't, it didn't make me feel good. So I was like, all right, um, try another doom. You see, I didn't heal him up all the way because I was going to, uh, just try something here. All right. The unstoppable got staggered. Cool. Cool. All right. Boom. Some more staggers. And then I just went down. Don't ask me why, he just um, got in there. All right. So at this point, I'm like, okay. Um, now, let's use a team revive and may as well go, you know, uh, you know, use up some of these uh, health potions, these team health potions. I never use them. You see, I'm capped out on them, right? So we go back in with Doom. And if I remember correctly, this is the last Doom attempt. There's the parry. And I'm like, okay, that's enough. That's enough. I'm I'm just done. Because, you know, that, that's just a waste of, of all that health. Okay. Look at look how much damage it's doing. Alright, so I got at least a little bit in, but of course he went unstoppable right when he needed to, so he could block most of it. And I went down. I'm like, okay, you know what? That that's that that's enough. That's enough. Let's go back to Kitty. All right. And I was like, I know Kitty can do this. You know, I saw Legacy um, doing it, and I'm just like, yeah, but he's better. So you know, he could he could do that, right? All right. So here she go. He he just ripped me up real good. I'm like, all right. Now that time I was waiting for his special three, and I was like, okay. Ah, and I was like, yeah, I got the special three off, okay? And I'm like, I mean, I got the uh, phase when he did his special three. And then I said, wait a minute. I got a special three. So I'm like, all right, let me fire that off. Okay. And this is when it happened. I'm like, hold up. Look at that power gain I'm getting. What the... And I'm like, oh, true focus. Look at this. I'm like, hold up. I'm legacy. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I just got back to it. And I'm like, and I was looking up at the um, timer. And I'm like, hold up. Look at this. I'm like, come on, hit me. Hit me. Look at this. And I'm back to a spot. I said, oh, wow. I said I could have soloed this. That's all I needed to do. It would have been a longer fight, but it would have been done. Look at this. Is he? As long as he's aggressive and he's hitting you like this. Look at this. This is insane. So, bad boy. How's that? How that looking? How that looking? This is the kitty cheese. And I stumbled on it. I wasn't even planning to do it. When I saw, I was like, wait, how did I get to a bar? 
Uh, a full po How did I? A special three? And then when I got out of it and he started hitting me while I was phased and I saw how much power, I'm like, what? And I'm not taking any damage because she's awakened, of course. And I said, wow. This is crazy. This, honestly, is even crazier than Ghost is at times. Because with Ghost, I would have to have Hood on the team and I would, you know, have to make sure that he fired his uh, special three off when she was um, phased. But this right here, this cycle, is insane. And like I said, I saw Legacy do it, but I didn't know how he did it. I didn't know why that worked. But on this note, there's a true focus, if I remember correctly, and that's what's doing it. And I think, did I? I can't remember if I, I did a, a mutant boost. I, I don't remember if I did or not. I don't think so. I think I did a cosmic boost the last time, but I don't think I did a, a, a mutant boost on this. So this was just crazy. After this, I'm just like, if I had done this from the beginning, we would have just soloed it. Long fight. I would have just put on some music and let her go. Or just sped it up a little bit and uh, let you guys watch the cheese. Just look at this. Long as, long as he's aggressive. Now, see, if he decided to go passive, our phase would fall off and we could be in trouble. But as soon as I get up, special three. And it, it's really more of a hands-off. Let your character just go at him, walk right into him, and that's it. Look at that. As long as he's aggressive, we're good. Okay? And then he caught me right there, but I didn't care. As soon as I'm getting up, that's another special three to the face. Look at this. Ooh! Man, 5% health, 1%. 1% health. Now, I was tempted... I was tempted to break out of this cycle with that 1% and just, you know, get him done. But I was like, nah, let's finish it the way we started this cycle with that. All right, so that's going to do it, guys. Um, let's see. I think I show you guys my final um, objective. But, man, that cycle, that kitty cycle right there, wow. Wow. I I honestly had fun using Kitty for this run. And I feel like I've learned her a bit better. Still not great, but a bit better. Okay, so that was the final objective. And as you can see, we've got all of them done. All right. Um, I think I showed it. I might have showed it at the other uh in the other um video as well. But uh I think I showed all of the uh, max milestone. This was fun. That tech advancement was fun. Um, but going down, going down. Isn't that beautiful? Max peak milestone reached. All right. So that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.